So we're doing our grocery haul. This is our first one for me, but I thought, why not? I kind of want to be active on the channel. And I thought to myself, content can be created from literally anything. Why am I stressing out about it, you know? So I'm going to be doing a grocery haul for you all. I feel like the grocery is like my favorite place to go, which it is not. It is not. But I did saw a method that someone said to buy your groceries weekly and not monthly because food can waste and stuff like that. So yeah, I'm going to do all the stuff that I got and like what are some of my favorites. Let me know what is your favorite groceries to shop at. My personal favorite is extra foods because they always have deals. They have their 20 value deal basically where you can get like four items for 20 two items for 20 stuff like that so i like to shop there but y'all let me know which one of these are your favorite groceries to shop at in trinidad all right so let's start strong right so i saw that they had this deal for cheerios i i honestly don't understand why imported cereal is that expensive in trinidad like i understand it's not going to be the same price as local cereal brands i get that but it is excessive. Like I would buy these same brands in Walmart for three US dollars. And that's still lower than the price that they are being sold here. It's just ridiculous in my personal opinion. But hey. So they had this Cheerios on sale for $31. And you got the two little milk in the deal as well. So I like that. I was checking the expiry date. It's not expiring anytime soon. And Cheerios is one of my favorite cereal brands. I don't buy it often because it's too expensive in Trinidad. But when I travel, it is my favorite to eat so when i saw that they had it on sale i thought yeah i'ma get that i'ma get that Next, so moving on to drinks i've been seeing this one since last year this is how it looks so y'all could check that out it tastes okay it doesn't really taste to the level of shandy but it's like it's not bad so i got that one if you don't know about angostura still chill know about them now these taste so good and i like to buy the little mini ones myself two canned cokes as well so this bag is done all right, we're moving on to the main bag now. So this is the snack bag. And certain snacks I don't enjoy anymore, actually. I used to be a really bad snacker. My dentist and I have always been in communication all the time. Um, yeah, but now as I'm getting older, I don't eat the same snacks I used to when I was younger. The snacks I eat now, I actually look at the sugar intake. And I feel like a little old person doing that. But it's fine. Like, currently, it's my time of the month. And usually, like, when I get my period or oh, girl chat jumping in our girl chat here when i get my period it usually comes like hard medium blah, 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 whatever right but two months now i've been getting it so badly that i've been throwing up and feeling extremely weak and like my body was just like not my own because i couldn't move and stuff like that and i was like is this normal and it is normal it's a sign of endometriosis which i never had before i don't know if i'm developing it or not I don't have the same symptoms as i did last month which was awful i don't recommend and what i did is that someone gave me advice to not eat sugar the week coming up to my period and i did that and i don't have any pain at all this might be the easiest period i ever had before so that's a little tip for you if you have endometriosis or you have pcos or you just you know like you just have bad periods sometimes don't eat sugar leading up to the period and ginger tea is really good as well i also drink okra water and all these different things and i think that kind of helped to this period being like so easy also, fun fact, did you know that your period is actually a simulation of pregnancy? It's a contraction and we get 10 contractions when we have children. So yeah, I'm not going to have children anytime soon. Putting that out in the universe, I don't want kids anytime soon because I'm not going through that. Moving on, this is my snack bag. Um, But when I am on my period though, I have really huge cravings and I don't want to fall into eating sugar for the pain to come back. So what I try to do is look at the sugar intake of everything that I'm buying i'm gonna just show you all that so these little danishes that they have now they i think these have been out since the beginning of the year they taste so good and i feel like they're really good for like an on-the-go breakfast or like after meal snack so that's why i got it my favorites this one is my all-time favorite they are only five bucks I also bought this banana bread because i saw that this is a new product that kiss brought out so i want to try it and see if it tastes good i'm actually do a video for that on my tiktok so go check me out on my tiktok if you want to see me trying that so the danish let's look at the sugar intake right 13 grams of sugar i also got a little kiss cake as well it is 30 grams of sugar in this one you all see how much, how much sugar we're consuming right 
I know what I'm doing. Like, I had a grocery run yesterday or day before, actually, and I got grapes, apples, watermelon. I've been on fruit bowls like crazy. But when these cravings hit you, all I have to quell the cravings, honestly. And I was craving snacks. Um, okay, I saw that they had a rough tops too for 18, so I got that. I haven't had a rough top in a long time. It brings back so much childhood memories. If you're from the Caribbean, drop below when last you had a rough top. Also, they had Kruma, which was a reasonable price, so I got that. I used to get these all the time when my mom would go to the market. She'd always buy me, like, gulab jamun, which is a big fat Kruma. So I kind of had a liking for that for a while. So all these snacks that I got in my snack bag. Now we're moving on to the last bag. One more snack in here, I didn't realize. We have a Pringles, go-to Pringles. 